Hey guys, welcome back to a random episode of Gibson's 92. Um, give you guys the latest and exclusive content on new music, entertainment news, and inspiration quotes by me. The Queen is back. Um, Alright, so I want to do this video. So it's been a long time coming for this um, new inspirational video. And I want to do this because a lot of things have been happening. Um, and I just want to give a lot of insight and, you know, positivity. So I want to talk about us uh, using our third eye. Um, I definitely can say that um, it's good to protect, you know, your energy. And I have been um, having conversations with, like, other people um, online on YouTube about protecting our energy, uh, making sure that, you know, we take care of ourselves. Um, and don't let people, toxic people, drain our energy. And about me, you know, I'm the kind of person, I'm positive and, you know, I get along with anybody, but I can't stand toxic people. I can't stand people that try to take advantage of others. I definitely can't stand people who, you know, they're wolf in sheep's clothing. And um, I feel like what you have to do is just navigate and just be very careful because nowadays, you know, you got some people, they're up to no good. And this is where the scary thing is, too, because... I've also had been having like dreams that have been telling me things too. It's like I don't know how you guys um, have you guys had like had a dream or have had dreams that told you something that maybe something might happen or could happen, but you couldn't put your finger on it or they tell you, oh wait a minute, this is bad, or like maybe it could be like your inner calling or, or something like that. But you also want to be able to just take one day at a time and you know just make sure that you know you put yourself first and you know you don't own nobody nothing and don't let nobody dim your light but I have noticed that people have been revealing how they have felt hurt um how they have felt betrayed by people to be friends family members whoever that they dealt with and they really are they end up being you know narcissists I will do videos on narcissism too because I have to get to the core of it but like I said also your third eye can help guide you um, how to know when to fall back or you know steer you in the right direction or path because I don't really think that I mean in this day and time you know we do have good people in the world but us good people you know sometimes unfortunately we do you know get you know um people try to be slick so i say throw a gallic gun that's gonna work yeah it definitely will work because it's like when you know like your worth and know who you want to be then you know you don't take ish from nobody and I really like that people are really, you know, reflecting back on their life. And, you know, even with me too, because I can see from my experiences where I have used my intuition, you know, my inner gut, my feeling, um, capitalization letters that told me, my senses told me, nah, this person ain't good. Or this person is a bad person. Um, this person is, you know, sketchy, um, whatever. But I also use that third eye to empower me as well because that's good to, you know, use it to empower you and also, you know, be a badass at it as well. So you just be calm and cool and collected. Be, you know, yourself and, you know, don't, you don't have to um, be, um, you know, you just want to be able to just do things um when it comes to your time when it comes to like your dreams your goals and you know your third eye will help you navigate throughout the world you will run across beautiful people you will run across good people that will help you will guide you will enlighten you and will not be afraid to also be vulnerable with you as well because i know that's one thing vulnerability is something that we all know and we all like have you know experience and even like our own like um, trauma you know it takes a while for people to really push through and listen you know I'm a person like I said when it comes to like things that people have t 
told me about, you know, themselves and, you know, what they did to help themselves and get them back right on track and have a sane mentality and just, you know, live life to the fullest. Never give up. Um, and also keep in mind that, you know, your spirit is what keeps you going. Um, and this is one thing I love to do too. Because I do observe people from a distance. And then I can tell and I can spot well, who are good people, who are bad people. And those other people you already know. Hell no. Um, you know, them evil spirits. So what I do, I just be myself and have a conversation. Also, that's another thing. Having a conversation with a person. You read between lines. Um, and that's another thing too where people can really uh, decipher and pick up on energy. You pick up on people's um, body language. You pick up on people how they talk. And you see how they, who they really are. You know, once you get the hang of it, you know, we're not experts or nothing. But I know one thing for sure, you just got to be careful from messed up people. And people who are narcissists and people who, you know, they really are, you know, messed up. But, um, like I said, using your third eye, it would be able, you'd be able to be like, you know what? Okay, cool. This person is whatever. I'll just let them be. Um, or, like I said, this person seems to be cool. That will help me. That is genuine. And sometimes I know when it comes to people that have trust issues, um, believe me, I'm like that too. But I'm going to talk to, like, um, about how some people they've been hurt and some people they've had like issues with people not being trustworthy and um you know they you know they they really make sure that sometimes when it comes to like their self-worth they may feel you know that they aren't happy in their life and people's happiness is important so that being said i feel like your third eye will keep you sane and you will be able to one day realize hey you know what i'm just gonna go for it and i'm not gonna doubt myself i'm gonna use my instincts the first time and like i said i will be able to you know push through so um i feel like yeah we all have a third eye that you know can help us and really it will save us a lot of you know hiccups along the way too so that being said guys um yeah using your third eye is wonderful it's great um and yeah so i will read this quote it says when you start utilizing your third eye to seek truth you will then learn to see that the divine is within you oracle underscore of light and that's the quote for today i hope you guys enjoyed my uh, new video please do not be afraid to share your thoughts and honest opinions please do not be afraid to stay tuned on the next episode of get the sense 92 please do not be afraid to like share comment subscribe down below please do not be afraid to hit that subscribe button please do not be afraid to hit that notification button and as always stay tuned on the next episode of get the sense 92 dragon ball z never reference peace for bye girls asking out the super saiyans out